Kimiya Yi Sa'adat Persian, Kimiya Sad English, The Alchemy of Happiness was a book written by Abu Hamid Muhammad ibn Muhammad al-Ghazali, a Persian theologian, philosopher, and prolific Sunni Muslim author regarded as one of the greatest systematic thinkers of Islam. The Kimiya Yi Sa'adat was written towards the end of his life shortly before 499 r. 1105 AD. During the time before it was written the Muslim world was considered to be in a state of political as well as intellectual unrest. Al-Ghazali, noted that there were constant disputes about the role of philosophy and scholastic theology, and that Sufis became chastised for their neglect of the ritual obligations of Islam. Upon its release, the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat allowed Al-Ghazali to considerably cut the tensions between the scholars and mystics. Kimiya Yi Sa'adat emphasized importance of observing the ritual requirements of Islam, the actions that would lead to salvation, and avoidance of sin. The factor that set the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat apart from other theological works at the time was its mystical emphasis on self-discipline and asceticism. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Structure The Kimiya Yi Sa'adat and its subsequent translations begin with citing some counsels of the Prophet. Overall, the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat has four principal parts of ten chapters each Ebadat religious duties, Monjiat salvation, Mu'amalat human relations aspect of Islam, Molakat damnation. Topic <laughs> Sa'ada. Sa'ada happiness is a central concept in Islamic philosophy used to describe the highest aim of human striving. Sa'ada is considered to be part of the ultimate happiness, namely that of the hereafter. Only when a human being has liberated his, her soul completely from its corporal existence, and arrives at what is called active intellect. Al-Ghazali believed in practical ethical perfection and that by exercising his God-given capacity for reason man must be drawn to the spiritual alchemy that transforms the soul from worldliness to complete devotion to God. This alone, he believed could produce ultimate happiness. Ghazali's teachings were to help man to live a life in accordance with the sacred law, and by doing so gain a deeper understanding of its meaning on the Day of Judgment. Kimiya Kimiya or Kimiya alchemy is an applied and mystical science that has been studied for centuries. In its essence, Kimiya represents a complete conception of the universe and relations between earthly beings and the cosmos. Religious philosophers emphasized its importance as a religious discipline. Due to its spiritual dimensions Kimiya is considered the noblest of all occult sciences i.e. astrology and various kinds of magic. Ghazali was himself a believer that everything on earth is a manifestation of God's spirit, thus everything belongs to Kimiya. Ayyure Ulam Eddin It is a common misconception that the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat is a rewrite of the Ayyure Ulam Eddin. Ayyure Ulam Eddin was written by al Ghazali after abandoning his duties as a professor due to a spiritual crisis, which led him to live in seclusion for several years. It was composed in Arabic, and was an attempt to show ways in which the lives of a Sufi could be based on what is demanded by Islamic law. There are definite parallels between Ayyure Ulam Eddin and Kimiya Yi Sa'adat, however, the four introductory chapters of the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat contain relevant theological discussions that set the two apart. The Kimiya Yi Sa'adat is noticeably shorter than the Ayyure Ulam Eddin, however, in the original Persian introduction of the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat, Ghazali explicitly states he wrote Kimiya Yi Sa'adat to mirror the essence of Ayyure Ulam Eddin and a few of his other theological writings. He wrote it in Persian so that it could reach a broader, popular audience in his homeland. <laughs> Translation and editing From its original Persian form the Kimiya Yi Sa'adat has been translated into Urdu, Turkish, Azerbaijani, and German. Hussein Kadiv i Jam edited the first half of the Persian text nearly two decades ago. 
This version is considered to be the most beneficial, as it improves upon the past editions by Ahmad Aram and Muhammad Abbasi. In 1910, Claude Field published an abridged translation of the Kimiya Yi Saradat utilizing the Urdu translation of the Persian text as well as an earlier English paraphrase of a Turkish translation by Muhammad Mustafa and Nawali. Elton L. Daniel, a professor of Islamic history at the University of Hawaii, compared the texts given to him by Claude Field to the Persian edition and reorganized the sequence of the chapters and paragraph divisions in order to get them to correlate better with the original Kimiya Yi Saradat. He also added annotations indicating the areas in which Field's translation varies from the original Kimiya Yi Saradat, where certain texts were omitted, condensed, and identifies many of the individuals and Quranic citations found in the text. The most recent translation of Kimiya Yi Saradat was published in 2008 and was translated by J. Crook. Most scholars agree that nothing can compare to a complete and fresh translation from the original Persian text. God has sent on earth 124,000 prophets to teach men the prescription of this alchemy, and how to purify their hearts from baser qualities in the crucible of abstinence. This alchemy may be briefly described as turning away from the world, and its constituents are four Knowledge of self Knowledge of God Knowledge of this world as it really is Knowledge of the next world as it really is See also Persian literature Alchemy and chemistry in medieval Islam <laughs>